Hello guys, uh, welcome to Tech Design. Uh, in my previous uh, tutorial, I have explained you mirror assembly with uh, uh, two options inside. One is reuse and uh, reposition, and the other one is uh, associativity uh, mirror. So in this video, I will be explaining another two. If you have not uh, watched my previous video, you can just uh, go to the assembly you know tutorial uh, playlist and you can just check it. Now uh, we have a uh, mirror assembly command over here as you can see here I'll just click next and I'm just going to select all the components and let me go to next and here we have to select a datum plane so I'm just going to select this datum plane with 100 mm of uh, distance and I'll click ok and by default this will be selected because uh, it has been created inside the assembly window. So now we have to click, click on next and here is the uh, in the previous video I have given a suffix as a mirror and let me give a suffix and then I can show you how that naming comes and you can just click next and in this window we have to select uh, uh, you know uh, by default this pre re uh, reuse and reposition is selected so previously this associativity and uh, re reuse and reposition is explained so now we have to uh, come to non associativity meter mirror so what i will do is i will just click uh, non associativity for uh, all the components okay now this is done now let me click next so as soon as you click next uh, the whatever the mirrored assembly will be generated as you can see here in the right side so this is generated and we have some preview here if you want to change anything uh, any component to our reposition or associative you can just still have an option to select that and now we can click next uh, sorry finish as you can see here uh, now we have uh, suffix so uh, so it is mirror is added uh, after the naming so in this uh, non associativity uh, the component will not be associated with the pre uh, the parent uh, component if you want to move it uh, it, it can be moved uh, individually uh, it does not have any associativity with a parent uh, body suppose see you can see here is so click ok and uh, the component will be moved irrespective of this position of this parent body so this is how uh, uh, this um, non associative works i will just explain you what is the another uh, type uh, and then uh, i know that uh, you'll be having a confusion between reuse and reposition and uh, what is the difference between the reuse reposition and then uh, this uh, non associativity uh, mirroring so before going into the difference uh, let me explain you the another type that is uh, So we have one here uh, exclude so suppose if you want to create a new assembly and you want to exclude some of the components and uh, suppose you have the same same number of uh, same uh, assembly in the mirror and uh, just wanted to remove these nuts and uh, use the different nuts in order to do, do that you can just exclude these nuts you can see here you can just clear that uh, uh, the you know this cross marks uh, indicates that this is not going to mirror and except this whatever the components we have selected here all those go going to be uh, mirrored i am just excluding those two and uh, as well as this uh, let me select this handle where is the handle okay handlebar as you can see here this is also i'm just going to exclude okay there are two handlebars and uh, two nuts so i'm just going to exclude all these two nuts and two um, handlebars so as soon as you click next and uh, the mirrored assembly will not be having any handle as you can see here the handle is missing as well as this uh, nut is missing so this is how uh, the next option works which will uh, remove the component which you which is not required for us in the mirrored assembly so now we have a uh, question uh, difference between reasonable position and then a non associative mirror so in both cases we can able to you know move the components irrespective of our uh, parent so in order to explain that i will just do control z okay now we have here and let me select all the components okay and 
next so what happens is uh, suppose for example uh, some of them i will keep it as a you know um, a reuse and reposition and some of them i will just change it to you know non associative okay so let me change it change them to non associative okay as you can see here some of them are uh, non associative and some of them are uh, uh, reuse and reposition so i'll just click next and now our judge uh, mirrored assembly will be generated and as you can see here um, non associativity uh, will now will only be allow you to change once the window is closed whereas reuse and reposition will uh, try to you know uh, position the component with a different way as you can see here 6 of 6 as i explained you previously if you want to change you can just change it this is the only difference between the reuse and reposition and the non associativity but uh, as far as my knowledge is concerned uh, reuse and reposition will not be much useful uh, this uh, whatever the cycle of positions will be here they will not be much useful you can use the you know associative mirror and the non associative mirror as well as this uh, exclude so exclude can you know uh, remove the components which uh, will not be required for our mirror assembly so i hope you enjoyed uh, my mirror assembly uh, you know tutorial please subscribe to my channel and hit the like button as well as share my videos thank you guys